Vilky would estimate it that they would need to make 100 small bets to get to six breakthroughs at Hewlett Packard. So whether you're an entrepreneur or working inside an established organization, the point is that you have to be willing to be wrong a lot in order to discover something new. And uh, you know, a lot of people will say or think or believe that you know they look at the Apple example and they say, well, there are certain people or certain companies who just have a knack for coming up with ingenious ideas. And I can assure you, having spent time with a lot of Apple people, that they try hundreds of prototypes for every new product and that they have to fail a lot before they discover something new. So you have to have this more of a willingness to be imperfect, to learn as you go, and then you know the rewards are that you end up discovering things like the calculator.